Hi folks, it's Robin Clayton and I want to welcome you all back to another episode of Zodice at the Farm. Uh, I'm doing well today. I hope everybody out there in the world is doing well and staying isolated. Uh, I do believe all this is going to pass. So faith not fear is my motto this week. So anyways, today I'm going to be making this beautiful uh, it's a dragonfly back uh, supporting plate, which is amazing. And then I've got this purple flower with this green vintage with that handle uh, soup bowl. And then this uh, multicolored uh, seafoam green uh, orb. And then I finally have this beautiful amulet, okay? So I hope you'll stay with me because I'm gonna give you the tips from A to Z on how to complete this beautiful flower, okay? See you soon. Okay, so I have this beautiful, this is a beautiful uh, dual dragonfly on flowers. It's just an amazing piece and you can see the dragonflies on the back as well. So this is this is um, 17 inches wide. Okay, so that's going to be my first place, first plate. I've already cut these already. So uh, if you have questions on cutting uh, any of your dishes, you can go to uh, my video section and look for uh, how to cut glass using a drill or a drill. All right, so I've got this plate, and then I've got this purple flower. And then I've got this adorable, it's actually a crystal, oh, but I love the handle. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that right there because I'm gonna actually hang something from this, this um, handle. All right, so I'm gonna put that right there. And then finally I have my orb, okay? So it's gonna come out magnificent. All right, so let me take this apart. And the first thing I'm going to do is um, go ahead and get my toggle ready with my washer and I'm going to turn this bowl on its side and I'm just going to go ahead and put that hook right there. All right, and then I'm going to turn it carefully back over just like that and I'm going to go ahead and put another washer in. Okay. And then the next piece will be my uh, purple flower. And I'm just gonna stick that right, right like that. Okay. And then I'm gonna go ahead and put on another washer just like that, okay? And then the next thing I'm going to take is my green uh, soup bowl vintage. And I'm gonna go ahead and stick it right through just like that and then I'm going to go ahead and put my next washer just like that okay now I've got my hand supporting the back so I'm going to go ahead and take my toggle and I'm just going to go ahead and okay now you see I've gotten that started just like that I'm going to go ahead and flip this all the way down as close as I can and then I'm going to go ahead and push in my, my top okay and take my Phillips head and begin tightening the top I really hope you all are really having a wonderful day if you're home I'm sure you're getting a lot of things done that have probably needed to be done for a while so far just go have a great time sitting outside. Just do something that makes you feel good because that's really what it's all about. Without hurting others. Different options for this particular plate. So I went ahead and I have attached the chain, a different chain here. Okay, it's a small chain. The chain actually looks like that, okay? I'm going to take this little one here. I'm going to pass pass that through just like that. And then grab my chain and go ahead and place this on the chain. And then I'll tighten it down. 
Okay, so let me pick this up and show this to you. Okay, so that looks really pretty with this uh, star hanging down, does it not? I think it looks amazing. I really think it just adds a ton of charm to the plate. It would also look really good here would be a white bow, okay, right through this, uh, this handle here. But I think that the star looks great as well. Okay, all right, so just some options in working uh, with a uh, soup saucer with a handle. Um, you can make something very beautiful and creative. Okay, see ya. I'll give you a viewing of this particular flower, this purple and purple dragonfly flower is what I'm gonna call it. And I also wanted to show you how this little star here actually accents and adds charm to this beautiful piece. Not that it needed any more charm, but a little trinket there to really give it um, a little bit of charm. So this is, this is it on the stand. You can see the beautiful dragonflies on the back, just like that. And then on this side, there's a blue one. Okay, so this is the final on this particular piece. I hope you love it. I know I do. If you have any questions uh, with regards to this particular piece, you can put it in the comment section below, or you can email me at zodiciatthefarm at gmail.com. Uh, but please, I encourage your comments. Uh, I'd love to hear what you have to say. And I'm just so glad and blessed uh, to have you join me here today. And uh, take care of yourselves, and I will see you next week here at Zodiciat the Farm. See ya. Bye-bye.